Hey guys, this is my welcome back to Malaysia video and I was just gonna do like a massive ore feeding just to show you how much how much these guys love the stuff. So here we go. Oh yeah, and this is the new bridge that I got installed. Watch this. Whoa, that's a prune shark going a bit crazy. The catfish, obviously really hungry. With him, we just get some more. Going crazy. We love the stuff. It's a prune shark going mad. And the tiger shovel nose red tail cat hybrids. Love it. They can eat up to three or four full cups of these a day. But I feed them every other day. Um, the other days I feed them their spirulina pellets to give them a balanced diet. Ooh, the prune shot sucks it all up like a vacuum cleaner. And yeah, this is the new bridge I got installed. It's three foot by three foot. As you can see, there's been a bit of renovation at the house, the outdoor area. And you can see like this new landscape there. And um, yeah, it's all a lot of change. I, I put this three foot bridge so that during the day, the fish will have a place to hide when it gets really hot because they need a bit of shade because I don't know if fish can get skin cancer, but I think it's possible. So at least now like the fish have somewhere to hide. So it feels safer. Prune shark. Sucking the rest up and I'll put one more, one more cap full of massive oils. I buy them by the kilo bags. I wish we had bigger pellets, but that's the biggest I got. Yeah, I'll put them in the middle so you can see better. Yeah. The Oscar. See, my gouramis have grown so much. There's one of them. And there's the other one. Both over there. I love seeing the prune eat, it's so entertaining. It feels crazy. I don't even know how many dollars he's sucking up for every mouthful. The hybrids. He may look small from this angle, but Prune Chuck's he well over three feet. He is huge now. And he's a belly to match if you can see him from a side profile. And you can see the turtle going crazy there. Love the stuff, my turtles both love it. The prune has outgrown the hybrids by crazy now. He's just he doesn't stop growing. And as per special request by a special someone called Cat Nguyen, Dim Sum needs his five seconds of fame. Dim Sum, come here! That's Dim Sum, my pug. Dim Sum! Good puppy. Good puppy. Good boy. Good boy. And um, I also wanted to show you guys my new fish tank on the video in case you guys um, didn't see it on my Monster Fish Keeper website. Um, you should just um, search TLKMDN on monsterfishkeepers.com and you can see the um, the pictures at my profile there, but I'll just show you my new tank. Check it out. Turn on the lights. Nine foot by three foot by three foot custom tank. Extra thick glass because I told them I was going to be keeping monsters. And yeah, it's pretty huge, and I haven't um, stopped it yet. I just have a few, um, I have a lot of plecos in it just to clean the, clean the glass, as you can see there's one there. Just clean the algae, and I put some koi in to test out the water. But um, yeah, here it is. I don't really know what I'm gonna keep. It's a huge tank, but I'm probably gonna put rays in. I was thinking about pimas, but you know, reali realistically, no one can really keep them. They're a bit too big, but um, I don't know if I can be tempted to buy them, I might. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Custom, everything custom made. So I'm really excited because I've been shopping for fish and I love stocking. It's my favorite part of this hobby. Anyways, peace out. I'll do another. Um, I'll do another video when I get my new fish for this tank. So see you guys.